The Einstein-Podolsky-Rosen EPR, paradox is a concept in quantum mechanics that was first proposed by Albert Einstein, Boris Podolsky, and Nathan Rosen in a 1935 paper titled, Can Quantum Mechanical Description of Physical Reality Be Considered Complete? The paradox highlights a fundamental issue in quantum physics related to the concept of entanglement and the completeness of quantum mechanics as a description of physical reality. The EPR paradox begins with the idea of entanglement, where two or more particles become interconnected in such a way that their quantum states are linked, even when separated by vast distances. According to the principles of quantum mechanics, the properties of one entangled particle are instantaneously correlated with the properties of the others, regardless of the distance between them. This phenomenon appears to violate the principle of locality, which suggests that information cannot travel faster than the speed of light. Einstein, Podolsky, and Rosen argued that this apparent non-locality implied by quantum entanglement posed a challenge to the completeness and accuracy of quantum mechanics. They believed that there must be hidden variables or additional parameters that, if known, would provide a more complete description of the particle's states and eliminate the need for non-local correlations. In 1964, physicist John Bell formulated Bell's theorem which provided a way to experimentally test the predictions of quantum mechanics versus those of hidden variable theories. Subsequent experiments based on Bell's theorem, such as the Bell tests, have consistently shown that quantum mechanics accurately describes the behavior of entangled particles, thus favoring non-locality. The EPR paradox remains a foundational aspect of quantum physics, highlighting the counterintuitive nature of quantum entanglement and the ongoing debate about the completeness of quantum mechanics and the fundamental nature of reality. It has profound implications for our understanding of the quantum world and continues to be a subject of intense theoretical and experimental research. Subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.